serious wahala. Tunubu bows to pressure, sacks two powerful persons four days after appointment into office. Tunubu don't talk calm. In don't talk and say anybody that refused to bow to his instructions or order or that refused to follow his instructions should be ready to leave office. He said, I am the chief driver. Anywhere I drive it to is where you will follow. Or else. Let's check the content, my able listeners. This is today's news. According to Bola Metunubu, Victor Akinjo has been replaced as the Ondo State Delegate appointed to the board of the Niger Delta Development Commission, NDDC following President Bola Tunubu's approval. The president gave the order to have Otito Atikasi take his place. Additionally, Tunubu chose Orok Otok Duke in place of Asi Oku Okang, the River State representatives. Member of the ruling of Progressive Congress, APC, in particular, has criticized the appointment of Akinjo and Okang. Ajuri Ngalili, the president's special advisor, announced the replacement in a statement on Friday. President Bola Tunubu has approved the immediate replacement of the NDDC's Ondo State Representative nominee, Mr. Victor Akinjo, with a new Ondo State Representative nominee, Honorable Otito Atikase. The statement said, The President has equally approved the immediate substitution of a new Cross River State representative, Honorable Orok Otuk Duke, for the NDDC's choice for the position of Cross River State representative, Mr. Asi Oku Okang. Dr. Samuel Obuku, who was the NDDC's most recent managing director and chief executive officer, is also appointed for a second term and will continue in that position while waiting for the Senate to accept his reappointment. To know who need to waste time, you don't talk and say that there is no time to waste time. Anybody that refused to follow his order or instructions is out. See what he did to the uh, former ministers of. Uh, uh, the, the ministers of uh, of Buari, uh, he didn't waste time to dismiss them. As as he's been inaugurated, immediately he dissolved the, the the ministers and you know dismissed them. He retired the one he want to retire, and dismissed the one he want to dismiss. He didn't even waste a single moment. Left alone the ones that he chose with his own hand. They could not dare to my people, not be smart. Um, you see, this is what everybody needs to know about the government of Bola Metunubu. Yeah, so far, he is the one that elected you or chose you, or he is the one that suggested you to the Senate. Know it that he will remove you anytime he wants to remove you. Yes, and that is why I laugh when um, uh, um, the Senate President Ababio is challenging his his authority that uh, he has been elected. He has been elected. That uh, there is nothing Tribu can do about it. <laughs> that is a very very serious statement, though. A very serious one because um, if Tunubu decide to remove him, well, he has already gotten a, a replacement. He's just waiting for the for the right thing to be done. Then Akbabi will, will see his way out of the of, of the of the Senate. You understand? And that is just it. Let's hear from you, my people. Let's know what you take on this. Maybe don't forget to leave your comments below the comment section. Click on the subscription button. Can you, can you